Joe, your first pro deal, you must be buzzing to get it all sorted. Yes, I am getting it all sorted and I'm really excited about it and ready to get going this season with all the lads. Fans might caught a glimpse of you in pre-season, sort of what you're about. What sort of player and position would you say you play? Um, the player position, probably left back is my strongest position, but I like to go forward a lot, so I'd say I'm more of a modern fullback. I like to get forward, get a few assists, a few goals throughout the season. So you mentioned you're versatile as well, you like to play a bit further forward if, if need be as well? Uh, yeah, if need be I can slot in the left wing or any, anywhere to be fair. And obviously you've been here since the age of 11 so signing a pro deal here must mean a lot more to you than others maybe? Yeah, it means, it means a lot to me. Definitely I've worked through the uh, stages throughout the academy into the 18s and now get my first pro deal it means, it means a lot. You spoke about the youth team there as well, what have Ross and Ross been like with you and your progression to the first um, team? Ross and Ross have been always supporting me, always improving me. Um, keep giving me the advice to get get into the first team, and now that I've done it, I owe, I owe a lot to them as well. You also, always been there. you also spoke about a record you share, uh, hold at the football club. Do you want to tell us a bit more about that? Um, yes, I hold a record um, for the youngest player to play for all the shop uh, first team fixture. It was in the FA Trophy two years ago. Um, I was 16. I played the whole game, so yeah, it's nice to hold that. And looking on that, how do you feel that you've come from there to where you are now, um, first team football? To be fair, I'm very surprised it's taken um, quite like, a short period of time. I thought it would probably take a bit longer to get my first pro deal, so I'm really happy about it and I'm over the moon and set more goals. And you mentioned the lads in the first team as well. What have they been like with you settling you in? Um, they've settled me in really well. They've um, given me advice to always improve on and they're really helping me become a better player. Before we talk about your goals and targets, well, I think George Fowler here has a question for you. Yeah, just off the back of what I saw you had for lunch today, mate, if you could just let everyone know what you put in your fajitas. Um, in my fajitas, I put in <laughs> rice, chicken, chorizo, chilli, a bit of chilli sauce, and yeah. um, a bit of fruit like mango and kiwi. <laughs> That's a disgrace. <laughs> Can we ask why the mango and kiwi in a fajita? Um, <laughs> it just gives it that little bit of excitement, you know? Just <laughs> a nice, a nice flavour to it. Do you have it on a match day? Is that what you had before a game? Um, probably, well, not before a game. I'd probably have it after the game because it's got the chicken and the rice, so a bit, <laughs> bit of protein. You haven't turned that into a real question, have you? <laughs> <laughs> just finally, your goals and targets for next season as well. Um, my goals are to get as many appearances in the first team, um, also to get the experience by playing men's football as well. So, just get a bit of experience. Are you in with a shot? For more information, click the link below. Click here for the next video and click here to subscribe.